was a high degree of trust on a kind of pragmatic basis on the part of Canadians with some of their institutions and some of their neighbors that when we're trying to achieve very measurable technocratic goals, we have this kind of sense in which we pragmatically trust. But I wonder, is that the same thing as the kind of sort of almost more existential trust that you need that's actually at the foundation of what makes a society? It's the difference between do I trust you with my RRSP and do I trust you with my son, right? Do I trust you with my life, you know? Those are two very different kinds of trust. And we may be doing really well in the one category, and it seems to me actually, and that, that's a good news story. You said it was a hopeful night, so let me have some hope here. And th that's a good thing. We should. It, it's great that we have, by and large, institutions that we have have mostly felt Canadians can pragmatically trust to achieve certain kinds of measurable ends. But do we trust each other in this much more fundamental way? I don't know. And that just my last point here that connects to something that Jeff opened up with, which is what are the sources to replenish that trust? When we have lost a kind of sense of sacred vocabulary, something beyond the mundane, the pragmatic that we achieve together, when we have lost a way to even talk about that, how can we build uh, that kind of very basic foundational existential trust together? I think that's a really, really important question and a really hard one to measure.